Hey guys, what's up? It's Jorge once again from San Jose, California. Today we're going to try to fix. I'm going to show you how to fix my computer when they have a problem with the solid light number three on the Dimension E E25. What is it? E E521 Dimension Dell Dimension E521. Uh, it had a problem. It wasn't working. Uh, and it showed me a number three on the on the front of the computer. Um, what are you about to see right now? That's what I did to fix it. Uh, we are not responsible for you guys to try to do. I don't recommend to do this if you don't know anything about computers. Uh, we're not responsible for any damage or anything you do on your own computer. Uh, we don't recommend to do it if you don't know how to do it. Okay? All right. Well, I hope you enjoy this video. Let's see. Hey, what's up, guys? Sorry once again from South California. And today we're going to talk about the computers. Uh, we got the Dell. Dimension E521. I used to have a problem when I put the computer on, it would give me a solid number three right here. Uh, and I bought another computer because uh, I couldn't figure it out. And later on, I find out that that was a hardware problem. And uh, basically, you have to just like check everything, make sure everything is right. So, I'm going to show you really quick. I already fixed the problem yesterday. And now I'm cleaning the second computer that I was using. So basically what you do is like open your computer, okay? And uh, if you don't know anything about computers, well, I recommend not to do anything. But this is this is what I was doing, okay? Uh, unscrew your stuff from here, from your processor. There's a screw right here. And there's another screw right here. Okay, when you unscrew that part, Basically what you need to do is there's like a little claps right here and you push in this part you push in like this and then it will come up. In the beginning it feels like it's not coming up because it happens to me. Uh, but that's because this part right here it's kinda kinda sticky with that where the processor is right there. So all you gotta do is just push it in and then you can see right here uh you can't see something. Hold on one second. Let me get a flashlight. Okay. I right, so just want to show you to see all this dust right here. Uh, it doesn't really look really good. You, you can see all this right here. And look at this fan right here. It, it really needs to be clean okay uh so all this right here it's it's no uh, helping the performing of your computer this is that processor right here okay this right here that's where your uh song cars and video cars goes uh memory run right here okay so basically all you gotta do is if you had that problem make sure if you have a, a video car or song car right here in this area uh Make, make sure that everything is, is really nice and tight. It's nothing's loose. Same with this. If you want, uh, you can like uh, take this off and then put it back on. Make sure everything is nice and loose. Uh, make sure everything is nice and tight. Nothing's loose. Uh, the same thing you can probably do with the processor. But if the processor you never touch it, I'll just just leave it like that. Uh, the processor is right here. This is what you use to open it. So basically. Now you can see this one here, this bad boy. Uh, it's really bad. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and uh, clean this and then put it back together. All right, guys. Uh, I use a brush. You guys don't have one of those. Uh, what is it called? Sprayers. You can use a brush too. Okay. So basically, just grab the brush and brush it off
so you can see right here it right it's already clean it looks right and no dots anymore and just done by a brush okay so uh, this is what I did to, to fix my computer uh, all I did is just clean it up uh, type the memory cards type the audio cards and the video cards uh, make sure that this is now loose the processor memory cards or memory runs the audio cards and the video cards uh, video card and uh, video cards and audio cards and then clean the, the fan okay and then clean the other part that goes in there so I hope you guys uh, find this information really good uh, and uh, thank you for watching my videos bye all right then we're gonna put this back basically this gotta click first right here okay just gotta click in there first right there and you just drop it right on the screws goes this this right here doesn't do anything it's just going there and uh, all I gotta do is just put the screws back on Make sure you tight it, but don't tight it like really tight, you know, just where everything is good. Don't like extra tight it or anything like that. Uh, then it's nice and secure right there. Everything is back where it goes. Okay, so let's see how it works.